Now, in order to be able to appreciate the power and the benefits of the Beagle Print uh, 3D printing webcam, we're going to go into a built-in web browser, right? So going through my PC, we're going to log in to the actual Beagle Print, and we're going to see what it sees. And literally, you're going to be able to monitor your print job from there, and you're going to also be able to start print jobs. So let's go and check it out. Okay, now one of the cool things about uh, this camera is that it's more than just a webcam, right? This is a, a, a solution that's going to control your printer completely. And a couple things are going on here. So if we go into the dashboard, you can actually see a lot of activities uh, that you can monitor. Uh, first of all, uh, you can load files or STLs that you'd want to print and then just run those jobs. And it's as simple as just uploading it once you've sliced it and then hitting print. Uh, here are all your controls for deleting and all that, that kind of crazy stuff. Right now, I sent a job to print, and you can see here is uh, the view to my ender. And this is connected via the USB-C uh, port. Uh, I can uh, see time-lapse videos that I may have already recorded. And these are the ones that are stored on the SD, and I can actually download them so that I can see uh, what it looks like. So I'm going to go ahead and download that, download that one. I can have a 3D view of what is going to be printing, and you can see what's going on right here. I could also see, well, that was a 2D view. This is our 3D view. You could look at the G code as well. So we'll give it a second for it to catch up. And you can see the G code that started here. And then you can look at your settings, right? And you can turn on and, and control what your time lapse is. So I can have it on or off. So you don't have to do a time lapse every single time, but if you wanted to, you could. So I just turned it off uh, for what we're going to be going over now. Now, if I click here, you can see what one of the time lapse looks like. And this was, again, the one we just downloaded so you can see the actual features. So this is pretty cool because with other solutions, like if you did a, let's say, uh, an Octoprint, you would actually have to get a Pi, you would have to get a webcam, you would have to get all that stuff installed and configured, and this is just one solution that does it all. Now let me show you what everything looks like connected to the printer. So here we have our camera, and you can see a couple things are going on here. We have this cable that's right here is basically going uh, to a USB-C uh, connector, so it's being powered. This one right here is actually going into our ender, so it gets connected right here. Uh, it does have a micro SD, and you can see the micro SD is right here on the side. And then all I'm doing literally is just having it pointed uh, towards the printer. Now, we're currently running a job, so it is actually loaded. It's actually, the printer is actually warming up, so I can feel it right here that it's already started to warm. And it's going to start the print. Everything can be monitored and controlled from the actual uh, webcam in this case. Um, and I can do everything from my phone. So the cool thing is I have peace of mind. I can just walk away. Uh, let's, let's say go to work uh, and then just allow this uh, job to print. And it's, it's literally that simple. There's no configuration. I didn't have to do anything to my ender. All I had to do is plug it in, uh, define the printer in the actual software uh, for the webcam. And that was it. It can't be simpler than that. So guys, that wraps up our review of the Beagle Print uh, webcam for 3D printers. Super easy to use and it's super convenient too.